welcome. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Lovely to see you. Now, when you walked out of the Big Brother house, you had your little toy with you. You haven't got it today. No, I haven't got that? it today. I gave it back to my girlfriend. Was... His name is Huggedy, you know, like hug, Huggedy. just Huggedy. Oh. And yeah, he was giving me comfort all the time when I was. So in the Lauren Big gave house. you that. Just Lauren gave me that one. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. And then you had a big old smooch when you came out. We all saw that. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> you know, I miss her so much. So yeah, absolutely. Oh. Yeah. And was she worried for you going in? About because you know, people, often people mm. reveal sides to themselves that maybe they don't always want to, or there's controversies. Or was she happy about you going in? No, I. Think I think everybody was worried, and so was I, yeah. you know? I mean, uh, you still put yourself out there. You never know what's going to happen. You're spending 24-7 in a house <laughs> with, well, strangers, probably famous people, but still strangers, and you never know what's going to happen. You never know where it's going to go. You never know which experiences you might experience. So I think everybody was worried. Do you forget you're being filmed or not? <sighs> Because sometimes you guys talk and we think, oh, you've forgotten you're on telly. Mm -hmm. Is it like that? The thing is, I did not forget we're getting filmed, but I thought most of it was going to get cut. Oh, I see. <laughs> so you make an assumption. So I yeah. was sure some bits, which afterwards, once I came out, everybody was like, yeah, so you knocked out the phone. I was like, shit. <laughs> I forgot we are live telling. Yeah, I apologize for that. We do apologize. Um, but yeah, yeah you I completely forget that you just you just try to live your life. Yeah. yeah. Why did you go into <laughs> the Big Brother back on house telly, guys. in the first place, Nikita? Because everybody knows you from Strictly. They know and love you. And obviously, yeah. the last series with Leighton was phenomenal. Yeah. Why do you think you? Why did you want to go into the house? Um, I just wanted to challenge myself, really. I just wanted to experience something I've never done before. You know, you you put yourself out there you never know what's gonna happen mm. you just I just wanted really to experience the big brother house just yeah you know I watched it when I was a kid and I never thought I was going to be there mm. and just being there was just such a surreal experience sometimes you had to pinch yourself and say oh my gosh you're in Has it this given you that house. new perspective on yourself then do you think yeah it did you know like yeah. first of all I'm seeing people which is a weird, weird thing, you know. <laughs> seeing, seeing people is a weird thing. But I was just uh, walking from yesterday around London, and I know it might sound a bit cliche, but you just appreciate things yeah. at, at the moment. I just appreciate people. I appreciate just the close contact. I'd yeah. have thought you wanted to lie in a darkened room and get away from people. <laughs> <laughs> Jill, and I, Jill and I were talking earlier. She's saying that, you know, because she did, obviously, The Jungle, or Queen of the Jungle, she won. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Um, but, you know, that things are very heightened, aren't yeah. they? Mm. And yeah. And so, you know, it seemed that, you know, you got on with everybody, really, but there obviously was a moment with Fern, <laughs> um, which, if, if you haven't seen it, um, Nikita mentioned, it paid Fern a compliment yes. about her yeah. shirt, and this is what happened. Never, never look at an old person and think they're just old. Referring to? When you said to me the other day, I like your stripy top. Stripes are in fashion, Fern. I like the jumper, Fern. Stripes are really cool at the moment. And bless you, you were passing me a compliment, but yeah. also like saying, actually, they're in fashion, as if it was a surprise to me. To be honest, I think this is getting no, a bit I'm out just of hand. It was just a nice compliment. It was nothing bad. And it was lovely. Nothing bad. Nothing bad. No, nothing, nothing bad. So, yep. you, did, yep. you yep. looked, <laughs> I have to say, you looked baffled. When yeah. she, that's why you went, sorry, we're we having beef here. You, you looked yeah. like you didn't really know what she was talking about because it was a couple of days afterwards that It she was a couple of days, back. yes, absolutely. I was on, in that moment, I was confused, perplexed, bamboozled, everything at the same time. <laughs> that's a good word. Yeah, bamboozled. bamboozled. <laughs> yeah, you can take that one. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Right, yeah. No, I was really confused um, on what are we exactly talking about, what are we referring to, but... Um, the most important thing is that we cleared it out in the end. Um, we probably misunderstood each other, and I'm always really sorry if I could end offend anyone in any way. Honestly, I have never bad intention, and so was anybody. If I'm paying you a compliment, like I said before, like you had a lovely orange jump, I love the colour. What are you it's saying, just... Nikita? <laughs> 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 a 64 year old woman. <laughs> did, did you, when you I'll played... take that, I'll when... take that. Yeah. It's just, it's just honestly, just. Honestly, because I think it. Sorry, if I Jill. say something nice, it's because I mean it. I have, yeah. I don't, I don't have any bad intention there. So. But you were saying about no, things being nice. I just wanted to know when you played that fun game after. Did you see it as an opportunity for a little? <laughs> <shoulder> <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> I saw it for the first time now. I actually haven't seen it yet. Do you have oh, gosh. any of the any of these clips? No, I have not seen. No, no, no. Um, but uh, 
Yeah, I'm really sorry for that to happen. Yeah. Honestly, it was just such... A it was fun, yeah. but once you put me into a competition mode, I was just trying to pop some balloons. Well, interesting. That's the dancer talking, in you. Talking about yeah. competition, obviously you have been dancing for, you know, since you were a youngster and you yeah. did competition dancing and you travelled around in competition dancing. So yeah. I would imagine, I'm an army kid, so you know we travelled yeah. a lot. Um, it, it's quite hard sometimes, isn't it, to form lasting friendships mm. when you're it moving very... so much. Yeah. So have you found that experience? And then what was it then like to be so concentrated, so much concentrated time with yeah. people when you're not used to that. Yeah, no, I think, I think for me especially the most challenging part was actually, and it's still probably today with how much I've moved, is making close friends mm. and spending so much time with people really threw me off. But I was really, really lucky to have to have just my boys with who I can talk to. You have Colson. Yeah. And layers. Exactly, yeah. mm. exactly. How, so, how did you feel when Bradley got... That was quite harsh, the way they... Oh. You all had your loved ones and then they brought him to the garden and then just got rid of him. Yeah. You were really visually upset. I, I just thought it was a bit unfair. To me, it felt so unfair because it was such a gorgeous moment. I mean, mm. we were all so happy. We were just cheering for each other. And just a moment before that, we were thinking, Bradley, you're the last one, who are you gonna get? Yeah. It's gonna be the your dog. dog. The, yeah, We're gonna, yeah. You're gonna meet your loved ones. And then it just felt like the world was crushing. And I just felt so, so sorry. And I felt like the world was just, it just was unfair for Bradley. I really wanted him to stay till the final. You know, he deserves the best. He's such a, such a lovely human That's being. That's what Big Brother does, though. Yeah. That's what yeah. Big Brother just does. You're saying about unfair, you put yourself up for eviction. Yeah. Would you change that decision? If no. you could do it all again? No, 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 not at all. I think sometimes you just need to make the, make the step forward. You just need to make the decision. It just happened that I took one more step forward than the other boys. It's, you know, it, it, it doesn't make me a coward. It doesn't make me a hero. It doesn't make anybody a coward. It just happened to be there. It just happened to the situation. And well, listen, I, just took I have it to and, ask well, you, because we are running out so. of time, Nikita. Yeah. Um, mm. Loads of people are asking, you are runner up there, does this mean we're going to be losing you from Strictly? Oh, no, 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 I hope not. No, you know, I love Strictly. Strictly is the only reason why I'm here. Strictly is the only reason why I could do Big Brother yeah. in the first place. I mean, they are my family. I love every single one of them. So Good. I hope to be back every single year up until I can or up until they want me, so. We always want <laughs>